I survived the New Orleans traffic. It was pretty brutal getting up here, but today I'm very excited. I'm about to catch a flight to Colorado to see a good friend of mine, Evie Burwell. I haven't seen her in probably seven or eight months. So I'm really happy I have the opportunity to go, go out there and have some fun with her and see the Rocky Mountains and whatever the West has to offer. Okay, so it's day two. I'm all settled in. Evie says we're gonna go hiking and explore some of these Colorado mountains. But she didn't say where exactly. That's where we going? Can't tell you. It's a surprise. She said it's gonna be a surprise, so I'm pretty pumped about that. Hey, Milo. Good girl. That's where we're going. That's our destination. We started down there. Starting from the bottom now, we're here. It's 
It's not a good uh, example of how far we've come because you can't even see anything because of the trees. Maybe the river right there? Yeah, maybe the river. That's how far we've come in life. Made it to the top. That's where we started. I'll repeat what I just said. Red blood cells, oxygen. Hi guys. Hi, how are y'all? I'm just gonna have you introduce yourself to everybody. Just, like, just a test of that. This one's actually called the big stump. Stump, yeah. What was the other one called? Stump Junior. <laughs> <laughs> Mountains to the left of you? Yeah. Is that even better than the Pyramid Mountain? Breathing so hard. Are you tired? Well, I'm winded. Just a little bit. We started here. Well, technically, way out there. Walked all the way up. Now we're at the top. <laughs> 